What is going on ladies and gentlemen, my name is Nicola Espresso and welcome back to another Black Ops 3 video here today on the channel. This one is going to be another one I'm not entirely sure how it's going to go. Simply because yesterday a lot of people took what I said out of context perhaps. Yes, how I said it was a little bit where it could have been misunderstood and I completely understand that and I'm all for people having different opinions here. And before we get too far into it, skill based matchmaking is not something that should be in the game. I want to make sure that, that is abundantly clear here before we get too far into this so that people don't rip me up before they hear what I'm saying. Skill-based matchmaking, I do not agree with it. That's the key thing here, but what I want to discuss today is a little bit more on the open-ended side here, more so opening up to questions to you guys, getting some discussion out of you, and really just taking a look at what is the placebo effect here within Call of Duty. Now, we've seen this previously in various different titles where somebody will think something, they will openly say it and not really have the necessary facts to back it up, and then somebody else will say, oh, that seems like what I experienced, and then they'll go along with it too, and basically it's just a tidal wave of people saying something that necessarily is not true. Now, whether or not this is the case here, that's something that is really what I'm opening it up to discussion here for you guys. Has this skill-based matchmaking discussion that has arisen in the past week or so really become something directly derivative of the outcome of the placebo effect? Now, as with yesterday's video, I saw that a lot of people were either on the side of not really caring and a lot of people really strongly for being against skill-based matchmaking. I got a lot of comments yesterday that really kind of I don't know how to put it, but it surprised me at how passionate, let's say that, people were going against skill-based matchmaking. They had some really choice words to say, and again, that is all personal opinion. I have nothing against that, just so long as you respect other people's opinions as well. Now, there's really no clear indication as to say, other than a few screenshots and some footage, that this is something that was implemented here, which, taking this now into consideration, it's been removed, so this is looking back at the past. It's not something that we're exactly examining right now for our immediate future within Black Ops 3. Basically, what I'm saying is, no matter what way you look at it, you have no concrete evidence. You could say that it wasn't there, but then you have those screenshots and footage that have people matched up with people no lower than, like, a prestige or two lower than them, but also no lower than really right around their score per minute or KD. On the same token, you can say that it was there, but also you can say that there were people that were the outliers that didn't get affected by this, and that developers are saying now that it wasn't even in there. Now, we're gonna add in a new piece to this equation where David Von Haar basically says it's not there, and I quote, let me get this out of the way so we can get back to having fun. First, I love you. I'll be as transparent as I can get away with. We did tune matchmaking, it was tweaked. I said as much on Friday as I tried to do whenever we hotfixed the game. It did come with consequences we didn't understand in totality. We also untweaked it the following day until we can investigate. What we didn't do is turn on or implement anything new that would deliberately prioritize any criteria over connection, and we won't. I am now going to decorate a tree, watch football, play video games, and then go see a show. Enjoy your Sunday, talk tomorrow. So basically what this is saying is the development team had absolutely nothing to do with skill-based matchmaking. Either it was something that messed with the algorithm for how matchmaking was set up very slightly to the point where maybe it did leave in these outliers where say a couple other people outside the region where you're supposed to be getting connected with got added in and as a result because there are more players you got matched up with more people that were in effect closer to your skill level. Basically bringing in the law of proportions where if you have more people in your area available to play you, then you're probably gonna run into some more players that are better or closer to your own skill level. Now on the other hand, that other option for our either or here is that it's the placebo effect. Somebody thought skill-based matchmaking and then it just spiraled out of control that way. Now there's gonna be definitely a lot of people saying maybe they're just lying, they're trying to cover this up, but when you have somebody blatantly saying that they did tweak match matchmaking, but it was not skill-based matchmaking, to me, I think that that's enough to say that it wasn't necessarily skill-based matchmaking, but some other aspect of the algorithm for matchmaking that was messed up. The blame is being pointed towards one specific area, but it's not necessarily the right one. So I think that's where we're going to wrap this one up here today. Again, I would love to hear your thoughts down there in the comment section down below. This is perhaps maybe even only an opinionated thing. Maybe you may completely disagree with me. That is perfectly fine. I'm only just shelling out here what was said by Von horror and perhaps why we may be overthinking and overlooking this to the point where it's been blown out of such proportion but that's gonna wrap it up though thank you guys so much for watching if you did like the video be sure to like rating down below any shares your facebook twitter and myspace if you want to check that out greatly appreciated if you're new here be sure to subscribe to the best of quality black ops 3 content any new news information you guys know exactly to find out of my channel thank you guys once again so much for watching i'll see you guys later take care and peace